Hello. Hey, how's it going? It's going great. So last yeah. time we met, we accidentally actually went even further back than where we left off. We actually left off on page <laughs> 33. I did not write my notes down That's right. Now I found it. I was like, oh, this is like so familiar, but like everything's familiar. <laughs> We've read this right? book thousands of times. Uh, so where we actually left off at was Koramu basically looking over at the castle and being like, um, gosh, I worked here so many times as like a foot soldier, basically, like when I got conscripted, that it kind of feels like I came back home was right. actually That's where right. we left off. They're, they're back okay. in, um, <laughs> they're in the, they, they brought her over to the whatever, blah, blah, blah. Anyway, the first two lines will be for you. All right. Arana wa kono kono. That's how she says it. I think it's chiku, but it definitely starts with chi. Okay. Yes, it is chiku. Arana wa okay. Ah, kono kono chiku o ano sumi naga wa ah oshi. Right, it starts with an O and has an S sound, but it's C. Yeah. Okay. Oshie kurenai de no shinden onita. Koerasu de wa shiro mono kami kamigami? Kamigami, I think. Kamigami, that makes more sense. Kamigami ga. Um, Sai. Mm -mm. Don't. It might be Matsuru, like Matsuri. Okay. Matsuri. Matsuri. Yes. Mm, yeah. Matsura Ureteiru. To. Kita kote ga aru. So that's going to be like in this sector district. Yeah. Um, Nagara? As they continue through? Yes. Okay. As they continue through this district. Um, they saw. And then, um, like shrine, not yeah. They saw a shrine, and I was wrong. That's not Oshieru. Um, Oshieru as a kanji. This this will make it make so much more sense, right? Oshieru um is very similar. The difference is that little thing right over there. Oshieru has child right over there. Uh, this right here is kazu, which is number. Oh, I believe okay. that does make sense. <laughs> So, so Kazoeru. Kazoeru is going to be like like numerous. Like yes. Numerous. There's a there's a whole bunch of Shinden. Okay, so as they progressed through this district, they saw numerous um numerous shrines. Hi. Um, like more than she could ever see before. Yeah, it's just countless. Okay. There is no end to the counting. That's the amount of <laughs> shrines. She had heard that. Oh, that's not. That's not she. That's. Yes, Hyaku. He ended. So. There were hundreds of varying gods, kind of like enshrined or worshipped. Yeah. Um, yeah, she'd heard that in chorus. There were hundreds and hundreds of gods worshipped. Perfect. So, the dake no kazu no shinden ga ari sou da to Arana wa omotta. Arana thought, man, this must be like oh, oh. With all the shrines she's saying, it must be like that amount of gods. So she says, like, oh, it must be like a hundred of shrines here, since, uh, mm -hmm. or at least. Sore dake means like at the very minimum. So she says, there must be at minimum a hundred shrines here. 
it seems like. Um, Kachu o mi ni matotta. Josei no gundan made iru. There even was a、um, military group of women wearing armor. And then it explains what、uh, place that is. Respira fogoryu. Roba, yeah. Should be like two, having two swords, is my guess. Okay. Ryoba no ono de. Don't remember that country. Uh, ono? Wait, or katameru. <laughs> the one I'm right in between. <laughs> me? <laughs> me? Okay. <laughs> Thank you.、Um, uh, Buki. Buki. No, Sky Kata, Mo, me, me, get baby. How are you? So, this is Joshi. So, this one is Kanojo. Kanojo? Okay. Kanojo Tachi no Stomata. Stomata. Okay. So, So, this is the shrine of the goddess, kind of in her mother aspect.、Um, so, That's going to be guards. guards. Yeah, it's the guard unit of the temple of the mother goddess.、Mm -hmm. Okay.、Um, so these women with double sided. With like double sided axes, right? Yep. It's like carrying. Double sided axes. Is that over their shoulders? Like on their bodies? Mio katameru is to, um, has multiple meanings, but in this context, it means to have in your assemble, yeah, to to wear. Okay. Okay, let's go and cut that. So that's gonna be like, and say, Essentially, they learned how to use them. They, they yes. These yep. Mi ni tsukeru basically means you learn to the extent that it's like、mm -hmm. engraved in your body, right? Mi's、okay. body, tsukeru is the attach. But yeah, it's the、okay. to master normally. Okay. So these women carried these big double headed axes and they were incredibly skilled with them. Hi, hi. Okay. <laughs> So, on basically, if a man tries to. Okay. <laughs> okay. It should be easier to ignore this comma, I would say. <laughs> so, starting with the subject, kotoga, I guess, <laughs> the verb is tomeru. So. Kind of they, their, their efforts, their, it, it was their purpose. Yeah, their, their purpose, yeah. To, was to, 
basically to not allow men to tread on the holy ground that was exactly the perfect anano wa ni yari to shita atashi mo itsu ga onaji yoo ni kachu o kiru kedo shinden no naka dake ni shi toji komotte inakute mo in dakara so um alana she little does a little smirk and she thinks the following line is that, you know, in the f one day, I'm going to also be able to wear just like them armor and stuff. But I'm not going to be locked up inside the temple. I'm going to, um, it's going to be fine. I can, I can wear this outside of the temple, basically, because she's going to be a knight. But the going to be a knight's not written in the sentence. Uh, okay. Let's say about there. All right. に、あ、登りさがが。Mm, I think it's like something else. That sounds kind of funky. Um, yeah, my got that sounds weird. Uh, Zenpo. Zenpo. Okay, Zenpo. Zen. So we got Shiro and Mon, but I believe Shiro gets the married reading, if you know what that is. Joel Mon. Okay, so our first line. So, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so suddenly the ascent became the incline became quite steep. Um and we had come to the end of the uh the religious district, the temple district. Um Okyu is like Shiro. Oh, okay, it's so like the palace. Mm. So, so, and at the top, on top of this, at, at the top of this incline, or this mountain, um, there was the royal palace. <laughs> And as it on the side, she, she gulped. She took gas. Yeah, I, th yeah, I think it's to gulp, but Iki is breath. So I might be wrong. Iki o, uh, and it's to it is to gulp. Um, it can also okay. mean to gasp. So, uh, you could you, the best is to have your one's breath taken away. So whichever. <laughs> Where you want to do that. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay, so like ahead of them there were the castle gates and basically there were a ton of people and animals. Um, uh, 
just like a ton of people and animals kind of traveling through them. That's a good guess. So what happened here, which is really confusing, is that the this is the verb. Uh, hori komare um, is in mareru, being like kind of passive form or something like that. It says to be engraved. So the thing oh. that is engraved is animals and um, a bunch of people. And contextually, it's probably engraved on the gates. Yes. Okay. And they are also irodorud. Do you know what that means? I don't think it's a common word. I'm going to guess it's kind of like gold gilt. There is. That is what's going on here. The word itself doesn't mean guilt, but that is what it is. It, it is guilted with that. Irodoru as like a word on its own just basically means like to color something or to okay. paint or to decorate in some way. So it's decorated with gold. Um, which, of course, means it was guilted. That's that they use a more generic, fancy word than the specific <laughs> word for that. Because there is a specific word for that. I remember seeing it in the past. <laughs> Whatever that is. Just like there's a way to specifically say gold-plated, for example. There's a specific word for that. Okay. Um, but yeah. Um, so next is my turn. Jōheki ni aita kono mon o tsu to to I think. Um, we all know what it means. So it's pronounced <laughs> always uh, up to grabs. Oh, yeah. Oh, he wa. Shikusai jitsu ni michi ni orite iku. Um, so they, um, go through the open gates of the castle walls right here. And, um, it, and the king and the queen. They will, on holidays, come down through these gates into the city. Um, so the general populace, when these gates, when they, when, when they, when the king and queen go through these gates, the general populace will come over to go over and look at their rulers on this um apparently uh, attendance day it can it can means like spectator it can, yeah audience with nobility and i guess that's a pacific holiday um mon wa um that jo jo heki to onaji takasa ni sobie tatteita so this gate it is the same height as the wall of the castle yeah, I feel like that this is wrong. This is to go through the, this gate. Mm -hmm. I mean, I, I don't know. This, it just seems random because we're all describing the gate, so it doesn't make sense to describe the characters going through the gate. I think it's just like a hypothetical. Let's say, okay. like, you know, I guess we're going back to this being the subject. The king and queen go through this gate when, when the... the from the castle wall, the king and queen go through this gate when they want to go down here. And going through this gate, the general populace can see it. Which is a little bit, like, awkward to do in English. <laughs> but yeah, that's what I would say is right. what's going on here. We're just, we're just describing this gate and what it's used for. Alright. So, okay? I think it's okay, yeah. Close. Hey, she. Hey, hey, tai has the same hey in it, and they both have the same meaning, right? Here's a hey, tai. Um, but it's just okay. this is more just one. But there's multiple probably in this context. I actually just did it, so it's harder when someone else reads it. <laughs> it's like, what vulgar? Yep. Okay. 
It is not on do. Not not okay. not to line up. あ、できる、できる。建物や、あの、そうか、あ、だ、だ、だんだん。よっ、だんだん。だんだんに、立ち、立ち、あ、立ちのやり、やらり。オッケー、立ちのやり。あ、ごめんなさい。いや、オーキュー。オーキューまで続いている。この中には、あの、この中には。It's a tan. Do you know what fountain is in, is in Japanese? Yeah, lined up. So contextually, probably more than one soldier, but um, not necessarily. But if you're lining up, you kind of need multiple things. So it makes sense to say there's soldiers lined up at the side of the wall. Versus there is a soldier lined up. Feels like, well, what is it lined up against? I guess you could say it could be lined up with the wall. But um, it makes more sense to say there's multiple soldiers in English anyway. Okay, so there were soldiers in the colors of the royal family lined up at the castle gate. So and inside the gate, you've got buildings and um, oh, this is also a building, but this is tower specifically. Buildings and towers. Okay. Ah, Dandan and Tachinobi were like kind of kind of like gradually. Um, I don't know. They gradually saw saw more of them. Oh, that's not quite right. Basically, yeah. Um, I don't really know why they're using Dandan as a descriptor here, but yeah, Tachinarabi, right, means that there's buildings, right, and they're all kind of like in a row. Kind of idea, right there. They're all lined up, okay. and Don Don feels like a step kind of idea. So perhaps it's being used because they're all kind of an equal distance apart. Um, okay. The different buildings kind of giving off that kind of vibe, rather than being more sporadically mixed around. Would be my guess. Mm -hmm. Okay. And that basically looks like this line kind of continued up through through the royal palace. Hmm. 
The other option is that there's just more, uh, as you go to the palace, there's just more and more buildings, is the, the okay. other option. Like, there's one over here, you get more stepper down, there's two, and then there's three. That, that's mm -hmm. the other option. Clustered closer. Okay. Yeah. Uh, yeah, perfect. And then inside, there are gardens and fountains and um, Kisa, which is... Um, where they hold their weapons, I think it's called Barax. Oh, okay. Barax. Oh, wait, sorry. Kusha is the stable, which is weird because you have a Koya. <laughs> Where's Barax? Is Barax is, I guess the, that's the Heisha, maybe, is Barax? The soldier oh, that building. Yeah. Okay. So inside you had gardens and fountains and stables and bricks and um, little sheds for the animals. Just all. <laughs> In the innermost palace wall, outside of the innermost pal palace wall, um, was the forest of the royal family. Perfect. That was a lot. <laughs> um, <laughs> um, こういうことは父の方にはチーズを呼んで知ってはいたけど、現実を見にしたアラナーは息もつけなかった。本を読んだ時には驚かなかったのに。So, Alana, you know, she has already known about this from when she's read them on maps and in, in her father's books. But when she saw it with her real eyes, her breath was just taken away. And um, it's kind of shocking because she wasn't shocked at all when she read it in the book. But in person, it's like, wow, crazy. And the next paragraph will be for you. That was uh, stables. What was stables? stables. <laughs> no, no, we just saw it. <laughs> it's like, I'm just gonna go to the last page. What was it? Uh, Kyusha. <laughs> Kyusha, that's right. Thank you. Kuromi wa Kyusha no soba no. That's like. Yeah, naka ni wa. Together, right? Naka. Niwa? Oh, shoot, Niwa, like the garden. Oh my gosh. Yes. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah. If this is Naka, that can't be um, Te or whatever. It can't be N. Went to the um, 
the stable feet. Oh, he went to the Nakaniwa. Nakaniwa, which is like the. What's the English word I'm looking for? <laughs> courtyard. The courtyard? Oh, yeah. 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 Of the stables. Or, no, no, so next to the stables. The courtyard next to the stables. Yes. Okay. I see. So here, this is where the basically the male servants. Male servants, yeah. That's why it's Boca. <laughs> so it's gonna be like this is where they. Oh, this is kind of where you hung back from. Yeah, it's uh, where they like wait. If. <laughs> So basically, kind of, they led their charges to, to as far as the their rooms. Um, and we're. So they're going to be like <laughs> taking care. The the male servants are going to be taking care of the horses. Um, yeah. And yeah. <laughs> So, before, oh, okay. So, like, basically, a male servant approached the two of them. Yes. Um, yeah. Imamo means, like, just now, basically. So, not only do the male servants take over horses and whatever, they're also, they're coming toward us right now, basically. Mm -hmm. After they talked about what is a Kora I'm doing, what is a male servant job. Um, uh, the next paragraph. Kora mo wa uma kara orita. Watashi wa tore bondoryo no kora mu sumai shon. Kyuden ni shika no suru aruji. Tore bondoka no aran ga isho desu. So Kora, he gets off his horse and he says, I am Kolam Smith from Trebondo, and my master, who um, is doing Shinkan at the palace, is Alan of Trebon, and I am with him. I don't remember what Shinkan means. Shinkan officer. Shinkan osuru aruji. The office master officer? I'm no idea what she calls me. <laughs> Officer, nani kore? Shikan o suru. I guess it's the saying like he, the master he obeys is my guess. The the master I am the yeah. officer of, but mm -hmm. officers not used like that in English. I don't think. Um, <laughs> no, <laughs> so, next paragraph for you. Alright. Um, Okay, um, I think it's K. Yeah. And it means, um, like, respect or honor kind of idea. Okay. 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 
It's basically, think about describing the bow. That, that's... <laughs> that'll probably... Kizoku. Yep. Um, I know it's supposed to be like a hostler, but uh, ah, a stable boy. Bate. Yeah. Bate no ko wa, uh, korasu no, uh, korasu ko, uh, memory ga, uh, tsuyokatta. Um, nitai mo, Okay. <laughs> so basically, the um, stable boy gave a little bow. Yep. Um, no. Um, so this Jusha Minarai, that's probably like squire or page, right? Uh, mm -hmm. um. Okay, so like... Okay. Oh, because... Mm. So like it wasn't as formal as a bow that be, because because she was a squire uh, or a page i guess um it wasn't as formal a bow as would have been given to an adult noble yes and it's like i'm gonna you know i'm gonna be taking care of your horse i'm gonna take over your horse basically um, said this uh, stable boy in a very strong chorus accent Yep. Um, and then he called out for Taimon. Yep, Taimon! Uh, <laughs> okay, no, safe go kita, hirotto shita wakamono ga, isoi de kita, nandai sute fan. So, um, a young man, uh, wearing the, um, royal family uniform kind of comes, hirotto kind of, I, my vibe I'm getting from that feels a little bit like, Ah. <laughs> I'm not sure for sure. That's how I describe it. Um, and then he says, What do you want, uh, Stefan? Um, so he says, We got a guest who is heading toward um, His Excellency the Duke, I guess. Um, I shall carry the saddlebag, and the rest of this page shall go to you. All right. I don't know what. Um, Oridu. Oridu. Thank you. Um, o orite. サビを and this is Eugene rather than Tomodachi. Eugene, oh, yeah. Yeah, you're absolutely right. Okay. Um, so, I don't know. 
got off uh, the horse and basically took a minute just to hug Tubby. Um, hug Tubby. Yeah, to hug Tubby. Um, basically feeling like she was parting from her last best friend in the world. Yep. Um, and then from there, basically she hastened after Simon and put on the, um, yeah. Yeah. Perfect. And apparently Hiroto is describing his appearance, which is that he's very gangly. Rather than being like, ah, I don't know, he, he, he don't feels like, ah, kind of like you're, you know, yank something. But it's his appearance. Just, <laughs> right. Okay, well, we definitely got to do this page. Um, first paragraph will be for me. Koshaku ni chitsurei no nai yoni. Koramo ga minimoto de unatta. Maho mo ken mo tsukai konasu. Um, make sure you don't act rude to the Duke. This is what um, Koram grumbles into contextually Meyer. It's not like specific, right? This is he grumbles into the ear. But contractually to Alana's, uh, mm. behave yourself, right? <laughs> um, he is going to be your greatest, like, leader, like the first main person who's going to be like mentoring you. Um, Study doing nine. I don't know if that's like the two without. Study doing nine. See, there's like an idiom that means that. <laughs> No. Um, Sky Konasu is like the work hard, I believe. So he's going to be working you hard with magic and the sword. Um, and he's just going to be your main uh, teacher. I have no idea what the fuck that is. <laughs> You're no longer two people. You're now one person. <laughs> your twin's not here no more. I don't <laughs> Something like that. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, yeah, absolutely. <laughs> Alright. Let's see. Um that one is Oh, I don't remember that last country. Uh, Hana? Oh, no, Hana. Uh, Hana. Uh, but um, there's Kou. Something at the very bottom there. Kou Shaku? Kou Shaku. Okay, thank you. Oops. Oh, okay. Okay. Kou Shaku ka. Shinjitsu. 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 So, Alana, um, kind of rubbed out her nose, kind of, like, worriedly, um, or certainly it kind of comes off as worried. Yeah. Um, and just like, what happens if something goes wrong now? Um, the Duke, the Duke, got um, Jesus. What if the kind of Duke saw through and discovered the truth? Exactly. Perfect. And I looked up Sky Konasu, that's why I didn't know which <laughs> country you were at yet. Uh, Sky Konasu uh, means the master. It doesn't actually mean to work hard. I feel like to work hard sounds very similar to that. Uh, there's so many to work hard. Um, <laughs> yeah. But it means the master. So I believe actually the saying is that 
there's no other person who's mastered the magic and the sword as much as this duke. Oh, that makes sense. That, that, that makes more sense. The, we have to get that. Why is that Futari in there? There's not a second, <laughs> is basically what he's saying. He's the only one. Uh, hi, hi. It's like, I need, I need to explain. I'm like, I gotta think. What is wrong with it? Um, Arana wa yokome de koramo mita. Otoko wa ase o kaite ita. Arana wa gutto ha o kami shimeru to. So Alana, she is still staring at Koramu, but not head on. She's looking at him out of the corner of his eye, her eye. Um, and he, Koramu, he is sweating a whole bunch. And Alana, she goes over and she kind of grinds her teeth together. And after she grinds her teeth together, she basically forces herself to um, look kind of forward and kind of like hardens herself. She's getting her guts all, all ready. She's like, okay, I can do this. Um, and she's like, um, I'm going to show him that I can do this is the last part. I'm going to bring this to fruition. She's going to show um, Koramu is a uh, Sean. And this might be the end of the chapter. Yeah, I think we finish chapter one. All right. Yeah. So now we full chapter. <laughs> Got to start chapter two. Woohoo! P- pretty exciting for <laughs> for these kind of things. We only meet once a month, and then we skip <laughs> our meetings. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> chapter two. You can see our nice two guards in front of the gate. That was kind of last chapter, but. <laughs> Close enough, artist. <laughs> better, better, I guess, uh, after than before. <laughs> okay. <laughs> no spoilers. <laughs> yep. Okay, so I'll stop sharing and the recording.